You know, we commonly hear that we have to have a purpose and it's important to have a long-term plan to make that purpose that we each have our livelihood. I want to be big on YouTube. I want this dream house and that dream city that I think of living in in the future. If you do not believe that's going to happen, you're putting limits on yourself. If we put limits on ourselves, you know, we're risking, you know, being complacent. You want this less attractive woman? Do you want to have children with this less attractive woman? She's pressuring you to get that smaller house. You're going to settle on that smaller house? Hey, you're having kids. Hey, um, you want to throw away your dreams and aspirations you had in your teenage years and 20s? I mean, shit, you got to go to this job every weekday. And you got to pay for... Oh, hey, I want a new cabin. Hey, kids need school supplies. Hey, kids need uh, this specific type of food. You don't eat it, but they need it. Hey, 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 hey. So it's everything just adding up. So uh, you think uh, you're going to reach your greatest potential? Do you think we're going to be the best version of ourselves if we fall into that trap too early? We're not. So that's the fear that keeps haunting me. <laughs> that's the fear that keeps haunting me, you know? So, uh, and when we post these types of videos, we're holding ourselves accountable to, no, I'm gonna focus on something different. I'm gonna focus on my purpose. I know my purpose. I just gotta figure out how to make this my livelihood. I know I'm doing the right things. It's just knowing when the next step is, that's the thing I need to figure out. I imagine big because I want to reach my greatest potential, you know? Once I reach a point where my purpose is to show people new places. And if I can reach a point where I can make that my livelihood somehow, if I can make that my full-time work somehow, that's when I'm going to check out and start a family. That's once I fulfill my purpose to show people new places and make it my full-time work. And it's important to understand that significant results will happen if we have uh, these two things we commonly hear. The discipline to consistently do the good habits and the patience. Not only will take time and we shouldn't feel too pressured at this age. Obviously, do the good things right now as early as possible. But just know, when it comes to patience, just know it's all going to be worth it. You know? Like, let's say you win the lottery. Whatever you think of doing when you win the lottery, make that something to strive towards. Not winning the lottery, but just what you would do if you would win the lottery. Make that something to strive towards. And have a long-term plan to reach that dream vision. You know? I dream of that freedom. I dream of that independence. No obligations, self-employment, traveling with others, showing them places they've never seen before, showing them the ocean for the first time, showing them the small towns of the country, showing them around Mexico, seeing how cheap it is, showing them Hawaii for the first time, touring around Europe. Some thoughts I have. It's important to save money for projects that help the process in turning your purpose into your livelihood. Also, think of some investments you've been considering. You know, a couple years ago, like 2020, I opened up like a stock portfolio, like um, made a Robinhood account. And uh, also I opened up a Roth IRA for uh, Vanguard. I just started early just because I was a uh, so I was at home all the time. I was just watching YouTube videos and found investing videos. That was interesting. And so I take action on it. And um, just know that when it comes to compound interest, it's going to be worth it. Especially when you're uh, between uh, 18 and 25. It's going to be worth it when you're uh, you know, 40, 50. You damn well know that. And um, right now I'm working a regular job. You know, a couple years. And um, I'm using it as a stepping stone. You know, just to get my social skills you know, in order, you know, because uh, I was uh, working 
you know, I was studying from school for a couple years, you know. So uh, this job helps me with my social skills, cold approaching people. And uh, damn, like this sales job actually does help me with my uh, public speaking skills. I noticed that. And then, um, yeah, but eventually I'm doing all this just because I know that when it comes to getting a mortgage, getting a rental property, I need a couple years of work experience. I need a couple years of tax returns. And uh, I'm, I'm only doing this job for that. After that, um, once I get like a, like a rental property, I honestly just want to be self-employed. I just want to do like Uber all day, like food and delivery apps all day. I just love the independence. I love the ability to just do it anywhere in the country. I, I love it, you know. And uh, I want to grow this YouTube channel. I want to be positive. You know, I love the positivity I'm seeing. I love you guys. And um, we're going to continue to grow our respective audiences on YouTube. Stay positive with one another. Only expect positive outcomes. <clears throat> you know, if you notice I'm saying some you know, a negative outcome, if I notice you're saying a ne negative outcome, the goal is for us to hold each other accountable. And... Um, I want to help the reservations of South Dakota. You know, they help fulfill my purpose because there's some people who never seen the ocean before. There are people who never been out of the country, obviously, before. And uh, these people, you know, they don't have uh, they don't have DoorDash, they don't have Instacart, you know, on the reservations. Uh, they don't have the they don't have the ability to get like stuff in bulk. Like you know how Sam's Club and Costco, you can get stuff in bulk. They don't, they don't have it on the reservation. Uh, the grocery stores are pretty expensive. And I want to be able to provide a delivery service to the reservations where I'll be able to make a living off of it or make a profit off of it. And uh, they'll be able to uh, save a lot of their own time, you know, being able to do what they want to do. And I'll be able to do what I want to do. And uh, I want us to keep going bigger because if we keep a positive mindset, believe, we're going to manifest the best version of ourselves our greatest potential believing it's possible having a positive mindset seeing a positive outcome on the road I love the journey I love you guys I know we're gonna do it to make our purpose our livelihood thank you for everything God bless you and I hope to see you soon thank you